Factorio Space Exploration. I've crashed on a foreign planet far from home. I will need to gather resources, research things, build a spaceship and get out of here. My ship explodes, bits flying everywhere. Will I make it through? Will coronal mass ejections burn my house down? Probably. I quickly discover my rocket ship still has some useful parts. I gather them up and start building a base. At least a starter base. Pretty soon, I've got some red potions, a little burner making some electricity, some green potions, and science is cooking. Next up, a simple mall, just so we don't have to build everything by hand. Piles of furnaces to smelt ores into metals, and piles of miners. We've got a starter base. Next, military science packs. Now it's time to get to know the neighbors. Would you believe this planet has biting bugs that would love to eat us for dinner? We install some radars so we can be prepared for our guests when they arrive. We build ourselves an ironclad yacht and get to know our new neighbors. We lay down our first logistics train network, building for the future. I learn of a neighbor to the east that is complaining about pollution. So I go to visit them and explain how I view the issue. Despite my lousy driving, we settle our differences. So I go to share my perspective with the next neighbor. They seem to have a different perspective on the issue. Nonetheless, I come back, but this time I wave a grenade around in their general direction, and that seems to do the trick. Time to automate iron and steel, green ships and stone and copper, all on the LTN feeding my new mall. The LTN network has grown. Next comes oil with one stop to receive fluids and one stop to deliver them, and another stop for plastic and sulfur. Our base expands and we switch to solar. The mall expands as well. My friend John and I have a different perspective on the value of wooden poles in Factorio. John, this pole automation is for you. Despite a lack of evidence, I convince myself my combat skills have gotten better. The bugs convince me otherwise. I tuck my tail between my legs and go home, gather a new pile of supplies, and remove the witnesses. I go back and automate efficiency modules. This should reduce pollution and make me a better neighbor. Okay, so I'm not a very good car driver. But a tank is kind of hard to screw up. I have a fun time demonstrating my new toy to the neighbors. I then automate blue science, construction and logistics spots, switch over to electrical furnaces, automate glass and everything necessary to build a rocket. And the rocket is ready to go. Time for the next chapter of space exploration.